We've been given exclusive access to Microsoft's headquarters in Seattle, a place normally off limits to everyone except top government officials and mates of the boss Bill Gates. You know, people like Bono. Every time Bill opens his mouth, it's a news story. And think about it, you've probably used one of his products today. Bill's influence is enormous, so when he invites you to see his house of the future, you know it's something worth visiting. The house is hidden inside an anonymous looking office block and over the years has served as a testbed for some of the most cutting edge technology to emerge from Microsoft. It's where they debuted tablet PCs and digital music. Let's go in. You'll unlock the front door with something you'll never lose, your palm. No more fumbling for keys. Hi house, I'm home. The home will listen to you all the time using microphones spread through the rooms, while sensors will respond to the daylight outside and create just the right conditions. This room controller allows you to set the ideal scene. Plus, you can also listen to any messages that visitors may have left you while you're out. And, no, it's not a projector. The clever bit is actually behind the paint. Television on. As you'd expect, the focal point, the TV, is a fully integrated media centre, certainly a step on from the one that we saw earlier. It's an all-singing, all-dancing machine where everything from your DVDs to your music can be streamed wirelessly from a PC in another part of the house. But this TV doesn't just entertain. It'll remind you about upcoming bills, control things like room temperature, and let you keep track of your family through shared calendars and GPS. Microsoft believe that in the future we will still be loving our bits of paper and our memorabilia and postcards. However, the family bulletin board may be made of intelligent fabric like this, a digital bulletin board. It's designed to react to what's pinned on it, so a party invitation will come with its own electronic tagging, which will not only let you reply directly, but will also let you know how many other people are going and remind you about other things you need to arrange. They use RFIDs, or Radio Frequency ID chips. Get used to the terminology, you're going to be hearing a lot about them. Essentially, they're like barcodes that allow their data to be read and then transmitted to a PC. In this way, business cards can link back to a shop, letting you know about special offers. RFIDs look set to be integral to everyday life, with many surprising benefits. Now then, if you can't cook, this is the perfect bachelor's TV dinner. You take your lovely soup, you swipe the barcode underneath the microwave, the microwave instantly recognises how long the product needs to cook and does everything for you. If, however, you consider yourself to be a modern man and prefer food to be a little more homemade, then perhaps you'll like the idea of this. Would you like some assistance? Yes, recipes. So, chocolate chip cookies on a focaccia. It'll then give you all the instructions on the work surface, just where you need them. Of course, by the time it comes to the UK, I'm sure Nigella Lawson will have bought into the technology and have her very own digital cookbook. Those RFIDs are back again, and this time holding information within your clothes. If I hold this T-shirt up to this mirror, it will tell me exactly how I should care and wash my clothes. And if I didn't know what to wear with this top, then the wardrobe consultant will suggest some possibilities. Yeah, jeans. You can't go wrong with those. Instead of just having a computer in your home, your home will become the computer. And my favourite application for all of this technology? Well, it'll be at bedtime, when the house turns a story into a performance. Start the story. Good night, Moon. In the great green room, there was a telephone. And a red balloon. And a picture of the cat.
cow jumping over the moon. Isn't that just the best way to hear a bedtime story? To begin with, we're going to look at some gadgets that have stood the test of time and already achieved iconic status. It's quite sensual. You can see how, with someone that you have feelings for, it is quite physical, that. 